What is up YouTube? I'm Hollywood Floss, the worst producer of all time. Back with another video. Back with another video. Back with another video. And if you haven't figured out already, I'm discussing loops today. Loops. Loops. Not making them, but what you can do to separate yourself and be different with the loops. Okay, if you haven't already, hit the like and subscribe button. Hit the notification bell. I'm coming with videos weekly daily hourly until we get to that 1k subscribers and when i get to that 1k subscribers i will drop a midi and a loop kit for free <laughs> for all my uh, supporters and uh, fans and um, it's just a appreciation all right so hit the like and subscribe button let's get to 1k quickly all right now like i said um in this day and age in the producer day and age, you know, it goes by eras. We have the crunk era. We have the boom back era. We have the bling bling era. Uh, we have the SoundCloud era. We have all these type of eras, all right? And um, right now, we're in the loop era for the producers, all right? Get a loop, get some melodies, chop them up your way, and put some drums to them, and that's the beat. Ta-da! But a lot of times, as we've seen, <laughs> some people get overzealous. They want to make it so fast. They want to get on so fast that they send out the same loops. They don't BCC in the email. So everybody gets the same loops. Now, you got world-class producers, good and bad. Um, and you got all types of people making the same, getting the same loops. What's going to separate them? All right. So today, I talked about it before, but I'm bringing it back around the corner. Looperator, all right? And Looperator is a VST plugin that allows you to manipulate a sample or anything I guess it's like a Fetrix on steroids to me I um, I have a Fetrix and I have Looperator I prefer Looperator so that's what we're talking about Looperator today um, I've talked about it before but I guess you didn't hear me so I'm talking louder all right so I picked out this sample this sample loop okay I'm pretty sure tons and tons of producers have this at 145 so I'll put the tempo at 145 now we're going to come in here put this on track two all right then we're going to go to the mixer all right so track two mixer we're going to open up that looper raider dog all right so this is the default setting on looper raider um like I said a lot of people get the same loop so how can you set yourself apart. Looperator does a great job of doing a slice tool, a loop tool, an envelope tool, filter, FX, FX2. Okay. You can also, it also snaps to your DAW. Okay. So this is just the first thing that you open up and look what it does to the loop. So already it's giving you a different, it's giving you a different texture than the original right so let's go back and let's let's play with it a little bit more all right let's see what it can do let's go let's go with a blank slate okay so obviously you want something different than the rest of the producer world because you know we'll jump on the same trend and do the same thing over and over again you already know how we are so the slice tool this is a tool where it'll slice the beat up in different parts and let's just see how that sounds Okay, so that's one thing that, you know, a little, you know, not too much, but it, it, the little things count when you're separating these things, okay? And then you can, it also has a randomized tool. You use dice. You can randomize it. Let's see how they go. Okay. So just something cool just for you to see. And then it even has how much you can, how much... It affects it, all right. You can turn it down all the way. You can leave it at 100. Now let's let's look at a loop. Let's see what this does. And this has three fours. Has all kinds. Of so already we're getting a different flavor just by adding a slice and a loop here. Now the envelope feature. Let's see what we can come up with. Now this is all on the fly, but just imagine if you spend time and you save your own presets like i can save this preset here that i'm doing right now 
Okay, cool, right? Like I'm already separating myself and not using the same basic tools that everyone else uses with the loop. All right, let's go down to filter. All right, let's add in a little filter. Get a little spicy on them. This is a distortion tool. This is a tape stop. We're going to add a delay. Uh, we'll add a tonal delay. And we'll add a tape stop right there. Even though. Let's see how it sounds. We're just messing with it. All right. Huh? We're getting somewhere. All right. And we're just messing around. We're going to do a phaser down here, and we're going to do a reverb right there. All right. And let's see how the original sounds. I wouldn't use this one. I would, you know, fix it all right. But I'm just showing you how you can take your loops to the next level, okay? And I saved the best for last. They got preset banks. We got an ambient. Let's see how uh, this one sounds. <laughs> all right, they got complex. Let's see you make something complex. <laughs> That's, that's not bad. Destruction. Okay, I already know. Hey, put your headsets down. Let's go with first kiss on destruction. Okay, enough of that. We also have filter. Let's just go with combination. And each one has, you know, a good 20 to 25 for you to get started off with. Harmonic. I mean, you can really go in and man, F up some loops, right? Dynamic pinch. From uh. One of my favorites, reverse, pure reverse. Uh. And feel free to go in and change the presets as well. Scratching, fast and slow. Uh. So between everyone jumping to use gross beat, halftime, and effectrix, separate yourself with Looperator, all right? My opinion on Looperator, I'm going to give it an eight and a half out of ten, you know what I'm saying? We came off of Scalar, I gave you the heat with Scalar, now I'm giving you another eight and a half, eight out of ten VST plug-in with Looperator, all right? Get that today. Looperator is firing and can separate you from having the same loop that everyone else has. That's why I'm never afraid to get, when people say, oh, send me loops or let's collab and we and they've sent it out to 10 other people. I'm not afraid because I know I have Looperator and I know I have the creativity to get around them having the same thing. Now, we, you both have Looperator and we use the same presets and all that and come the same, then we have a problem. But I don't think that's gonna happen, all right? So enjoy Looperator today. Remember, like and subscribe, get me to a thousand subscribers i'm dropping a free midi kit and a free loop kit all right it's your boy hollow wolf lost the worst producer of all time let me know what you think in these comments let me know what you think in these comments let me know what you think think <laughs> think in these comments i can't even do it looperator man enjoy it